overlay with a dream. To be the next Megan Fox, God help us. But the fact of the matter is, nobody tells you all the hoops you'll have to go through, all the casting couches you'll have to sit on, all the tops you'll have to take off. People move to LA to play in someone else's game. There's only so many positions on the field. I know better. I'm not gonna try to force myself in. I'm gonna start a whole new league altogether. Players will come. I just have to maneuver them. Alan's my name, now in LA. Moved here from Allentown, PA. Don't even ask, I've heard it before. No, really, I'm serious, like, it's not even funny. I'm in LA now. This is what I've been dreaming about. I'm on my way now. I smell success from here on out. My Nissan Sandra got me here. But I'll have my boards within a year. Cause I'm in LA now. I'm in LA. So it turns out that smell that I thought was success was actually my car overheating. I really need to find a job. town and I started all of them. I can't tell you which one was the best because that would be a conflict of interest. I will tell you this, each company held the unique tradition of staging Oklahoma every second and third week of September. Whichever one I chose to play Curly and usually beat out the other two in attendance. Jobs to stay afloat. Cause I'm in LA now. I'm in LA. Thousands of people all driving their Mercedes. Am I the only one who doesn't quite fit in? I'll get some sleep tonight and wake up in the morning. Officially tomorrow, my journey will be. 
never been to the city of Los Angeles, but I am very familiar with how big cities work. See, I, uh, I spent a week in the Big Apple in my high school show choir, and I lived in New York City for a week with uh, a touring group from college. So the thing I love about big cities, you don't need a car. You can just walk everywhere. In a city like LA, time not spent is time wasted. So, I have an interview with an agent today. Hope it goes well. Hello, Ian. I'm Richard Phillips. Nice to meet you. Thanks for taking the time. And to be fair, it's you who's taking up time, but it's my pleasure. So, what type of work are we interested in exactly? Well, stop, stop, right there. In this town, you cannot hesitate, ever. Thankfully, I am here to cover for your amateurishness. So, I look at you and I can see that you have a, a look. It's, it's not that look. It is the look, all right? I can sell you in this town like a side of sashimi. You're raw and delicious. They are gonna eat you up, they're gonna chew you up and spit you out. <laughs> so, I have a couple of auditions for you today. Already? Do, 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 do. Pshhh. Don't speak. Can you be at Regal Studios in five minutes? Y yeah. Wrong. It's at least 15 minutes away, not to mention the traffic plus the time it'll take you to get to your car. Did you park in the structure? Nowhere at work. <sighs> Make it 10. Thankfully, I called ahead of time and scheduled you an appointment before you got here for 11.30. That gives you 25 minutes. Go. Okay. Go. Go. Thank Go. You. you can thank me later. Dee, 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 dee. Psh, idiot. Ian? Thanks for coming in. You can take a seat. All right, we're gonna go ahead and have you slate. Dude. Say your name. Ian. A actor. And where are you from? Austin, Texas. Austin, great party town. Yes, um, it is. <laughs> and are you gay or straight? I'm straight. And uh, what kind of girls are you interested in? Characteristics. Uh, I mean, I don't know, blonde maybe? <laughs> what, what kind of show is this? The new dating show on MTV. Didn't your agent tell you? No. I. I, I... I did not spend the last three years at an Austin community college studying the likes of, you know, Strasburg and Stanislavski to make out with three chicks on a bus. I could do that on my own time. I already did. 